LA Mayor Karen Bass says the repopulation of a Hollywood homeless encampment that was cleared as part of her Inside Safe program would be gone by the end of 2023. Unfortunately, that is not the case. Even more people have set up camp under the overpass, and I would assume to Josh Haskell is live in Hollywood with what the mayor plans to do now. Josh? And David and Ellen, this encampment is starting to look a lot like it did when we first came here one year ago, right before it was clear. Businesses around here say that they're fed up. A few days ago, Adrian Snyder in the gray t-shirt asks a homeless man who he says lives at the encampment near Coanga on the 101 freeway to please leave the restaurant he's owned for 18 years, Solar de Coanga. The homeless man instead decides to throw a beer at Snyder, barely missing his head. It was scary. I have to call the police. I have to do what I call citizen arrest. I know, and it's hard because I have a son, a 13-year-old, and I know sometimes I have to put myself out there. Snyder says he was hopeful when Los Angeles Mayor Karen Bass took office and decided to make the first homeless encampment clearing of her inside safe operation, the encampment one block from his Hollywood business under the 101 freeway at Coanga. And although most who live there were housed, some spread out into the neighborhood, and one year later, the encampment has returned. I contact them probably 10, 15 times the last two or three months. I have emails that I send and everything, and nobody returned to me, and nobody, nobody even uh, uh, addressed it. So I would completely feel abandoned. I feel like it's putting a Band-Aid on a, on a bigger problem. So clearly, whatever she's doing so far, it, it's, it doesn't look like it's working. I guarantee you, by the end of the year, those tents will be cleared as well. That was Los Angeles Mayor Karen Bass almost one month ago telling Eyewitness News the repopulation of the encampment under the 101 freeway at Coanga would be gone by the end of 2023. But the new encampment has only grown even though a promise of inside safe was that all 33 encampments cleared would not return. We asked Mayor Bass about this on Wednesday. We're a little late, but I guarantee you we are going for it. What we're going to do immediately this month is go back to all of the sites and make sure that repopulation has not taken place. Nearly 2,000 people were moved off the streets into interim housing through Inside Safe and Bass's first year in office. But only a few hundred of the nearly 2,000 housed under Inside Safe have moved into permanent housing. I think it is egregious to have a de facto policy that says you stay in a tent, you stay on the street until we build a brick and mortar building. So temporary housing, I hope it's short, stay, but is a far cry from a tent on a street. Back here live now, a fence was put up after this encampment was first cleared to keep the encampment from coming back. A few months later, that fence was taken down, reopening the sidewalk. But as you can see, the sidewalk is blocked once again. Hello, I'm Mark Brown. Get more great ABC7 content by clicking the subscribe button for our YouTube channel and download the ABC7 Los Angeles streaming app on Fire TV, Android TV, Apple TV and Roku to watch on your TV.